Hey, how's it going everyone? My name is Sincastra and today in this video I am going to be bringing you guys brand new information coming in from someone who's hacked into the GTA 5 system So this is going on about the team roles in the heist So guys go into the description below and follow this with me so you get a better understanding Someone has hacked into it and they put it on a GTA 5 forum So I'm going to make it a lot simple for you guys So to make it a very short and not so long video for you guys I'd like to explain to you in the uh, simplest way possible So I'd like to start off by saying that a great example for me to lead into this video would be if you guys are going to hack into the Vinewood Maze Bank and you're to steal the gold there, you're going to obviously need to have a hacker, you're going to have to have the uh, gunman and the getaway driver. Now basically the guy who's hacked in said it will work the same as top fun missions and if you don't know what that is, that is hunters versus runners. Now he's found a lot of strings in it and he's basically found that there will be one to four teams. Now I'm not sure how many teams you can use at once but what we do know is that in the teams you can actually have uh, for each team. So for example team one you can have gunmen, for team two you can have hacker, team three you can have drivers and team four you can have pilots or bodyguards. Now he has led to a possibility of making this co-op so you can do this with a, uh, you and your friends and you can go against other people online. But I personally don't like hope it's like that. I hope it's against like standard bots into the game. It'll make it a lot more fun just for you and your friends and there will be like a lot of less BS going on if you're playing other people around the world because they could muck around and it can get boring. So other things that he has found is that there are many strings in it. Now I'm not sure what he means by found string but what has been listed down guys is that you and your friends have the options to be transporters, snipers, lookouts, defenders, attackers, hackers, demolition, runner, gunmen, bodyguards, pilots and drivers. Now that is a lot of things for you guys to actually choose from. Personally I'd be the driver, it sounds cool. Now that is all the information but I'd like to personally say I do hope Rockstar will make this a little bit better than it sounds. What I mean by this is for example if you're a getaway driver, say if you escape the cops in around 2 minutes you can get upgrades for your vehicle if you aren't allowed to use the ones that you have bought on, uh, on the online and you can store it in your garage. I hope for example you can add spoilers to your cars, make them faster with an engine etc. Or for example if you're a sniper you can add different reticles or you can have night vision or that might be coming as well but we don't know because there are in the uh, Los Santos a lot of um, in ammunition there are a lot of free spaces in the gun shop so hopefully we can see more of that in there and they can include the things which lead to the heist but that is all for today's video I do hope you enjoyed this information so if you did enjoy this video guys don't forget to smack that like button it helps me a lot and shows you guys support also leave a comment and tell me what you guys want to see in the heist and if you haven't already subscribe to my channel as I upload all the latest GTA 5 content but anyway thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video